This is your CBSLA.com News Brief. Hello, I'm Rick Garcia. Here's what's happening. A break in at the British Consul's home in Hancock Park. Police say a 14 year old girl called 911 and locked herself in a bathroom after hearing what she thought was someone trying to break into the home. Officers searched the home and the neighborhood. Student protests broke out after trustees voted to raise tuition at Cal State schools this fall. The 5% increase will mean $270 extra per year. It's the first tuition increase in the Cal State system in six years. Thanks to all the snowpack runoff, the LADWP will refill the Silver Lake Reservoir ahead of schedule. It will start in about three weeks and take about two months. Another cold, wet night around Southern California. The rain was coming down hard on the 5 freeway. In the Santa Clarita Valley, cars were hit with hail. There was also lightning and thunder in other areas. For the latest on these stories and your news any time of day, stay with CBSLA.com. Now here's Jackie Johnson with a look at weather. Thanks so much, Rick. Well, we do have that area of low pressure that's moving on out. So for a couple of days, we'll actually have some drier conditions. However, come Saturday, we've got yet another storm system moving in. This one will bring us not only wet weather, but even cooler temperatures. But by next week, it'll definitely finally feel like spring sunshine and warmer temperatures. Rick. All right, thanks, Jackie. That's your CBS 2 LA News update. Remember, we're always on. Be sure to watch us on CBS 2 News at 5, 6, and 11. And you can click listen live on our webpage to hear KNX News Radio and our other stations live anywhere you are.